Do you want the party light or lights on? Uh, maybe one. Oh, what's up, Chad? Hey, hey, how you doing? A, maybe that party light? Hell yeah. I'm not gonna screw it. Oh yeah, we got two party lights. Oh, it's in the... Uh... Oh, that one might be dying. Looks like it. There you go. That's better. start off with a really stupid sample per usual but lately there's been a bunch of young black men missing and showing up in rivers and a lot of people aren't talking about it so figured I'd just play you some news first and then the office of the chief medical examiner has identified the body found in the Connecticut River Friday as Springfield resident Shane Bailey. After Springfield Police Commissioner Cheryl Clapper said they will continue to investigate the circumstances surrounding Bailey's death. 23-year-old Ashin Bailey was last seen leaving Samuel Sports Bar in the Basketball Hall of Fame during the early morning hours of January 13th. On Friday, the Longmeadow Police and Fire Departments recovered Bailey's body in the Connecticut River near the area of Emerson Road in Longmeadow. Springfield Police have been working with Bailey's family and friends for the last two months in hopes of finding him alive. Deputy Trent Duda worked tirelessly and stayed on this case constantly and were in touch with Mr. Bailey's family and friends throughout. Every tip and every lead were followed up on and it culminated yesterday on the discovery of his body. The Hamden County DA said there were no signs of physical trauma to Bailey's body. The Springfield Police Major Crimes Unit is working to determine what led up to Bailey's death.
The next time you pull a stunt like that, I'll drill two holes through your dick so that when you pee, it shoots out in all different directions. You got it?
as he watches while I rip and cut and mutilate the innocent, his friends, and again, and again, and on and on. He is inside with us. He will never get away. His pain won't end. I 